I just made a video about a new Chinese electric car that costs 6,000 US dollars. In fact, this new Chinese electric car with over 250 kilometers of range is the same price as what it costs for you to replace the tail lights on a GMC Hummer electric vehicle. Just the tail lights. I kid you not. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel. I'm the Electric Viking. This is just a fun, quick video for you guys. I thought this was some interesting trivia here. The GMC Hummer EV, it weighs uh, an astronomical amount. It's over 9,000 pounds. I think it's the heaviest pickup truck that's ever existed in the history of mankind. I'm joking here, but it's insane. It's incredibly heavy. It's incredibly big. It's actually pretty damn cool, actually. However, if you reverse one of these into a pole or, I don't know, just actually have a little bingle, I hope you're insured. I really, really, really hope you're insured. Now, the new GMC Hummer EV is one of the most sought after SUVs on the market today. As you can see by its resale prices, people are selling these things for twice what they paid. I've seen them listed for over 200,000 US dollars, crazy. However, they're also selling at GM dealerships for more than the MSRP, in many cases up to 40 to 50,000 more than the MSRP. I don't like that, but it is what it is. Now, over on The Drive, a Facebook group centered around GMC's most powerful SUV ever, which is the Hummer EV, interestingly, somebody actually damaged their tail light. And they said, I had a shocker today, a new passenger side rear light for the Hummer EV is 4,000 US dollars just to buy it. In fact, 4,040 US dollars. However, the thing is, this wasn't a joke, right? Because it's actually worse if you consider the fact that that's just the light, not the actual housing. The MSRP on each housing is 3,045 US dollars before shipping, installation, or any other costs, right? If you include shipping and actually getting this fitted by your local dealership, it's going to cost you 6,090 US dollars. This is the same price as you can buy about, in fact, there's about 15 different electric car models in China you can buy right now for less than that, less. I'm not joking. Quite incredible that it would cost you that amount of money to buy just a replacement tail light and have it fitted. Now, interestingly, Car Scoops mentions that you could actually have to have your tail lights changed at some point in future because GMC has already had to issue one recall regarding the Hummer's tail lights. In fact, they also recalled them for battery problems, which seems to be a common feature, unfortunately, of LG Chem made batteries. Been another recall within the last two days for the Volkswagen ID3 and ID4 batteries too. Now, while this most recent recall included 10 vehicles only for GMC Hummer electric vehicle taillights. Other recent GM products like the Yukon are well known for LED taillight failure. So there's possible that your taillights could have a failure. What I'm trying to do here is if you own any kind of General Motors pickup truck, whether that's an electric one or otherwise, make sure it's insured and make sure that when you go to actually get it fixed, you get it fixed under insurance so you don't have to pay this ridiculous sum of 6,000 US dollars. Now, apparently there's a number of factors keeping the price of Hummer EV tail lights high, including the fact that there aren't many of them around. At the same time, I think it's unbelievable that tail lights would cost as much as an entire car. I mean, remember that car includes battery pack, uh, you know, a touchscreen, motors, four wheels, doors, uh, you know, body panels, the seats, there's quite a bit going on there that you're getting when you pay your $6,000. Even though it's a small EV, it still seems to be a fair bit better value than a tail light for $6,000. US Now, let me know what you think in the comments below. I, I looked this up. It's not a joke. It's actually true that it costs $6,000 US dollars to get your tail lights repaired. GM, if you see this video, change the price. That's a joke. It's ridiculous. It, come on. You can't scam people for this kind of money. This is going to give you a, you guys a, a bad name. And anyway, that's my thoughts. Let me know your thoughts if you're watching the video in the comment section below. As always, guys, have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.